hello guys we're back and now i i'll be doing a, a 11 combination that involves jumping jumping in 360 degrees just like in in onso and combining it with the with a kick while on the ground like doing the mawashi gear to roundhouse kick and tate tate okay just like in niju uh, side thrust kick and then last one is the 2b 2b uh, gary about using my knees i'm using flying high knees all right you can find this movement in the uh, Basaida, but in Basaida you will do it. Or Basaida or Gankapo, you will do it my Gary. If you remember the, the application of Lyoto Macheda in his fight with the uh, Randy Kotor, he used this uh, uh, type of movement. And all, but as I said, I'll be using my knees. Okay, so it's, it would be a jumping flying knee. All right, let's let's do it. I'll do it one by one. Again, the ne this one is 11, 11 combo. Good for training. Good in the uh, committee. All right, especially that there's a movement that you will go on the ground. Sometimes in a fight, if you got sweep, then you fall down, and at least you don't panic. Because you you constantly training this kind of uh, technique, you get used to it on the ground. See, you you have the feeling when you're on the ground and looking at the opponent. But if you're not training this kind of training, you always train on stand stand up. Then by the time you get sweep, in the stay on the floor, then that's the panic kick off but when you get used to it you'll be it's just like a uh, normal it's like normal training so we'll do it now of course first move is just like stand straight then you go here tattoo okay one and two see that one it's like a unso jump to then you go this way drop here and mawashi then this one goes under under flip your leg and step your leg on the other side then mawashi gave then other side one taki okay okay for me yeah okay Next one, keep on it, gap is okay. Then fake, then strike. Fake, then strike. Okay? Now I'll do it on the other side. Back side. One, two, three, four, five, five, six, seven. Then eight is. Move your, back, move your front leg. Eight, nine, ten. Eleven. There you go. Eleven strike. I I will do it again for the last time on the front front side. Yo. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. 
Eleven. There you go. Now, this type of training is not easy because of the uh, 360 jump. So, if you cannot do the jump, just I have a suggestion that you can do like this. One, two, crescent kick, two, back kick, and then All right. So that's one thing that you can you can do to in exchange with the 360 degrees uh, jump because uh, I know that, that that is hard for some. But of course, the uh, to the younger ones, uh, uh, it would do, it, it's not a challenge for them. It's not a hindrance for them to, to do the technique. But for some, they have difficulty in that uh, 360 jump. All right, so I, I hope you find the short video of mine helpful. And if you like the video, guys, don't forget to click and subscribe. Click the notif uh, like and the uh, notification bell. See you again next meeting and uh, keep on training. I was. Was.